Welcome to FXC Trade Assistant. I will show you how the program works. Let's start it. At the input parameters, you can find only the line properties. Every other settings are inside the control panel. At the control panel, you can find five pages. Control. Trades. List. Info. And Setup. You can open positions with the Instant Buy and the Instant Sell buttons. You can open positions also with open lines. You can use open line 1 and open line 2. When the price crosses the line, it opens a position. You can set up the lot size. You can use Fix Lot Size Percentage Free Margin USD Risk Percentage Balance Risk and Percentage Equity Risk You can set the stop loss in pips, USD, percentage balance, and in percentage equity. Take profit can be set also in pips, USD, percentage balance, percentage equity, and in risk reward. For example let it be 15 pips. Trailing stop. Ten pips. You can set the start of the trailing stop in pips. For example, at five pips. Break even point one. Ten pips. You can set correction for the new stop loss relative to the open price. You have part close option. For example, at minus fifty percentage risk reward. It will close 25% of the trade. It's 0.48 lots. Part closing will activate at minus 5 pips. You can find four buttons at the bottom of the control panel. The blue one closes the buy positions. The red one closes the sell positions. The green button closes the positions with positive float profit. The black one closes every trades. You can use close lines. Close line 1 and close line 2.
When the price crosses the line, it closes the trade. Let's see the trades panel. Here you can select the positions with the previous and the next buttons. The selected position is highlighted. You can select the positions also by clicking on its labels. There is a close button. It closes the selected trade. You can find a line modifier button. If you turn this on, you can move the lines of the selected position. You can modify the break even point, stop loss, take profit, and the other lines. At the bottom of the control panel, you can modify other settings of the trade. List page. Here you can find the list of the positions. At the end of each row, you find little red buttons. With these buttons, you can close the trades. Info panel. Here you can find useful information about the trading. Let's see the setup. The setup consists of two pages. Control settings. And advanced settings. At the top of the control settings, you can set the open lines and the close lines. You can turn off and turn on the ray of the lines. Cross option allows you to select between bid and close. When you choose the close option, the price must close up or close down the lines for cross. type. You can select buy or sell. Here you can set what you would like to open. For close lines, you can select between buy, sell or all options. At the bottom side of the page, you can turn on or off the stop loss, take profit, trailing stop, part close 1 2 3, break even point 1, and break even point 2. For example, let's turn on only the part close and the break even point options. Now, you can see, there are only break-even points and part closes at the control page. You can maximize or minimize the lot size calculated by the money management. Advanced settings. Now, the trade assistant uses hidden stop system, because this option is on. You can see, the trades haven't stop loss and take profit. The stops aren't sent to the broker. If you turn this off, each position gets stop loss and take profit. You can receive push notification, pop-up alert, and email, 
when a position closes. There are open button confirmation and close button confirmation options. For example, if you turn this on, you can open position only after accepting a confirmation. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Open line labels. At the labels, you can find a little red button. If you click on, it closes the trade. With the little gray button, you can minimize these labels. Line descriptions. You can turn on or off. Zero point line. This white line is it. This line represents the lot size weighted averaged price of the open positions. You can turn this on or off. Reset default settings. If you push this button, you can restore every setting. You have to know, Trade Assistant saves all settings continuously. If you turn off the robot, and then restart it, it loads every setting. You can minimize the control panel. Or move it to the left side of the chart. Close the cell positions. And let's close all positions. Thank you for your attention.